Yeah, we got game one between Geek Kid and Zigo. Ooh, okay, Zigo finally put that Olimar away. Yeah, and going for his main, <laughs> Meta Knight. Uh, so we used to have a lot of Meta Knights here in STL. We did. Now it's only one. Yeah. Now it's only Zigo. Which is so funny because you know, like you, you, when you think of STL, it's always Bayes, Meta Knights, and Nestus. So I don't, wait, I don't know about a lot. Wasn't it always just Zigo and uh, Fi? That's more than enough. <laughs> I, I guess. No, you're right. That, that's 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 too too many Meta Knights. Uh, oh, but that's those ladder combos. Fill, yeah, Geek Kid feeling the same right the same way right now. It's just getting laddered, but that's how I always feel um, against Meta Knight. Whenever I play against Zigo, it's just like I can get the percentage and get those uh, those combos, but. The same way that Meta Knight is able to kill me at like zero. Yeah. It's just so. Oh my god, I hate it so much. Yeah, it seems really scary. He's gonna have to really uh, be tricky with his movement so that Zika like does things like mess up shuttle loops or. Uh, he's also gonna have to. Be, a, a scary thing for Meta Knight in this matchup, I think, is that Zika or Meta Knight, Zika on Meta Knight wants to like go in and do what we just saw him do the dash tag. Uh, it's not completely safe on shield. Uh, I think sometimes Meta Knight dash tag can go through the opponent's shield, uh, but I think he has to do it like right on top of Ooh, the. Ooh, that out smash killing. Yeah, out smash killing. Oh yeah, kind of shocking to see Bowser die that early. Uh, I mean, 120 is early, I guess. But, I guess. Yeah. Uh, um, but yeah, so yeah, Zika or Geek Kid does have Red a decent. Star, okay, so right there. Yeah, like so that is what Gipi is gonna have to keep getting. He's gonna have to keep banking on the fact that Ziga wants to use moves that's going to end up putting him right in uh, Gipi's Gip face. Meta Knight may have a sword, but he's not like the kind of person that could just like keep playing hit or, hitting around and swatting him with the with the hitboxes. And, that's, and another thing that Gipi is really good at, though, uh, in comparison to all those things that you just said, mm -hmm. is just like he he doesn't get flustered. Yeah. He because he plays a character that you can't. And in Street Fighter, he plays uh he plays Zangief. Uh, Zang Zang yeah. Zang Zang well, not anymore. Yeah. Now he plays. Uh, I forgot well, he, Abigail. Or he something basically like that. plays rappers in every game. Exactly. Yeah, yeah and just knows that Ooh, he, he can't be flustered because fancy the, fire. Once he's able to get grabs, he's going to be able to get uh, basically a really good advantage to him. Yeah, I think it's a combination of playing a grappler, which you need to be patient to have, and the fact that he just has fighting game experience. Like he, he knows what he has competed at some of the highest levels in Street, uh, St. Louis Street Fighter, uh, so he knows exactly like how to keep his cool, and yeah. he knows that at, at any moment. The tides can be turned. And it's so, but it's so scary with Zika just pressuring him off stage so much. Yeah. Back air to back air, just. Yeah, Zika's always been really good at that. I think that was one of his uh, things that I felt like was. Uh, okay, it's a funny comparison between Zika and Fi, is Globo and Dristan. Zika, yeah, I, Zika I is the Dristan of Meta Knight, and, Glo and Globo is, uh, and Fi is the Globo of Meta Knight. All right, so now going into game two. All right, we're going to uh, FD. Final destination, a really good stage pick uh, for, usually for Bowser, mm -hmm. I feel like, just because Meta Knight wants to be able to run away uh, when he's not in disadvantage, uh, and I feel like he doesn't have platforms to go out of right. when that's the case. Uh, the other, uh, the, probably the other stage Ooh, that's probably a is, is sure. like Battlefield, but I think he, does, he can wants that lower ceiling. Up forward smash coming from Ziga. Yeah, that's probably the last time we'll see him land that way again. And and now he's, uh, yeah, he's trying to mix up the way he gets back on stage too, but he ooh, that's really ledge. high. He just keeps trying to go for ledge. Yeah, he's just getting from it. but at this point, with he's that far out, he kind of like, has no choice. We saw him try to go high, and Zika just hard punish him for it. But that back air putting him uh, in 4%, though, super close. Ooh, good ooh, down, down air. Down air, yeah. That almost killed. Now I feel like he's on the up throw up air percent now. All right, Zika off there. All right, pops him out. Is he, oh, he doesn't get punished. Sucks. I wonder if he could have down B to get the kill on him. Ooh, just going for the not air Not quite. <laughs> what was that? Uh, yep, not even sure why he decided to do a forest smash, but it worked out for him in that situation. Shuttle loop once again not working for Ziga. It never works. That's Oh, but that out smash is going to be able to take the stock, and Ziga's yep. going to go up 2-1 right now. Yep, same way he got it in the first game. Or same way he got the first kill. And Meta Knight's just so good at getting straight hits and a, lo a lot of percent. Mm -hmm. Ooh, but that's oh, going to be nice. a really good back air. Yep. Yeah, it feels like uh, Geek Kid's going to want to... Like... <laughs> Some, there's going to be some situations where he's one is just going to retreat to ledge because Bowser's notoriously bad at landing and Zika's just going to keep like dash attacking him and doing things to like pop him back in the air every time he lands. I feel like Geekit's not staying at the ledge a little bit more, just knowing that Meta Knight's a bad character if he has to get dash attack and not able to cross the Exactly, off. yeah. Um, Geekit's just trying to go back to center stage and mm -hmm. just get through those paper grabs when in reality he just needs to... Uh, Needs to put at put Meta Knight at a weakness. Okay, so there's another option. We just saw uh, Geek Kid going for an air dodge, um, which got him out of the situation. It's risky because he could mistime it, but in that moment it helped him to get away from uh, Zika's back there. Can you do it again? Yep, it goes for it again and it works. Uh, okay, so that 
Another fourth match. Up B taking on from the ledge. Team. Yep. That's going to be a quick 2-0 from Ziga, though. Mm -hmm. Yep. Ziga put him in a, in a place where he could have gotten punished by Geekit, I think, but Geekit had also committed to doing something really laggy. I guess Dines. because he expected that uh, expected that Ziga was going to put a bit more pressure on him. Dristan, where's Dimes? Can you go get Dimes? You're playing on stream next. Huh? So what are we getting next? Just in dimes? Yeah, just in dimes. And then I think probably gonna get you and Salty Dog on stream next. Okay. We can probably start streaming. It's only 1990. We can probably start streaming the rest of Winners. Winners. Okay. Yeah.